Hallelujah to Jesus. Father, we bless your holy name. We worship you, which of days be glorified in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you. Please, family, like this video, share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you as you do that in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. I want to pray for this person, you know. You are a very quiet person. What the Lord showed me, a very quiet person. You are not the type that easily reacts to something. But suddenly you have people around you who want to push you to speak the way you never want to speak. Who want to like make you look frustrated and all of that. You are somebody that loves to be quiet. It's not that you are silent. Maybe the enemy is silencing you. No. You are just a quiet and a calm person. You know, there are people who are like that. Everyone is different. There are people who are vocal, very loud. There are people who always talk, though they are, you know, everyone have their own uniqueness. Specifically, this person, you are somebody that is very calm. You don't love to, like, talk too much. You don't love to, like, talk too much, you know. Now the enemy wants to push you to a level where you will talk and talk and talk and be going insane. Where you no longer enjoy your life, the life that God has given to you. God gave you a life of purpose. God did not give you a life of disaster. God gave us a life of hope. A beautiful life. Hallelujah. He gave us the promises of life. He gave us, he said, go. Take over the book of Genesis. He created us in his image and, and likeness. He said, look at the, everything. Take over it. Have dominion over all these beautiful things because you know that we are unique. He placed all of all things in our hands. Hallelujah. They want to push you to a level where you can no longer enjoy your life. You just see yourself going insane, talking, 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 going insane, going insane, going insane, like you want to explode. The agenda of the enemy to push you to that level, it will not stand. Hallelujah. It will not stand. You have done all you can not to always speak because that is who you are. You love to be quiet. You love to be just like that. This is not about somebody is always vocal. I'm not saying that somebody is vocal. If you are vocal, you are not special. No. Everyone is created differently. There are people who can talk. There are people who don't want to talk. There are people who shout when they talk. There are people who talk less when they to talk with a little voice when they speak. That doesn't mean that, oh, this one is better or the other one is not better. No, every one of us is unique in our own way. Hallelujah. But this particular person, what they are trying to do using family, friends and all of that is to push you to a level where you start having some mental breakdown. This is an agenda of hell. I want to pray for you. By the power in the name of Jesus, every assignment of the enemy to cause you to go insane, let it be reversed in the mighty name of Jesus. And I pray every enemy assigned to carry out this satanic mission, we silence them now in the name of Jesus. We return that insanity back to them. They are the ones that are going insane. They are the ones that are going insane. Your life is restored by the power in the name of Yeshua. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remain your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.